Use Novi to bring together virtual and in-person learners to create a seamless blended learning experience. Watch the following product demo to learn more. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through how to use Novi for a blended learning experience. Um, so I think in our virtual world, uh, one of the things that we're facing is, is sometimes we will have an event and then we have people that have to end up joining online, whether that's last minute because of sickness or, or even because you have a global audience. And so you want to be able to include people, even if they can't show up for that day for that event. Um, and so this can be used, there's a couple different ways you can use it. You can use this if you have a completely virtual event or an in-person event. So I'll walk you through kind of both, both ways that you can do that. And so here's an example of like a training or workshop or event conference, how, however you would want to do it, where you have, you have a, a certain time and place that that event starts and you want to pull people in that also are, are attending virtually. And so the way you can do that is use Nobi as a presentation tool. So if I am presenting Nobi, let's say I'm, I'm running a, a workshop in person and I'm presenting Nobi on the screen, um, I can give the same link to everybody that is also joining virtually. So they can be following along with me. So I'm talking through this slide and I'm presenting it and we're all talking about it and then I say, okay, now we're gonna do a poll. Everybody go ahead and vote. So everybody will click on the answer, whether they're at home on the computer or whether they're in person, they have their phones or laptops out. They all click and then what will happen is I'll see their answers poll. So I'll see 20% answer this, 60% this, whatever. And so that's a cool way live to make everybody feel like they're engaged and participating. Um, then I can you know, do something like, Here's the video, we can all watch that together, and then I can ask a question. So once I get here, I'm like, what did you guys think about that? So if I'm in person, I could maybe collect some answers like you would a discussion, depending on the size of the event, or I could just have everybody start typing their answers. Um, and again, the people online can also be typing their answers. And then I can just share the group wall. So this is the group wall. And real time, as people click share to group, their answers will be popping up. So I can start, um, again, if, even if I'm in person, I can start talking through these like, wow, shit, that was a great answer. And Nicola, I loved what you said here. Um, we've had people, they give prizes, like the first person that shares their answer, they get this prize. And um, so you can have people online be um, sharing their answers and you can even be calling out their names from the in-person event to make them feel like they're part of the group that's in person. So it's just a great way to uh, not only engage people online and in person, but also even for the in-person people, <laughs> make them feel like they're joining a conversation, um, sharing their answers, and then they can reference all of this later. So they can always go back and find, um, still continue to look at the group wall, see what people are answering um, and so on. So this is just a great tool for creating blended learning experiences. Um, and then you can also stay connected. So anybody that has joined that workshop, they're all added to this group together. You can have as many as you want or as few as you want and they can continue to find each other and connect. You can send out stuff afterwards like surveys, follow up resources. So and people can even go through this in their own time after the event's over because it's designed they can just walk through it like they would a powerpoint but they're still answering questions and participating in polls so it it kind of continues to live beyond itself and so that's just a quick example if you have other questions please feel free to reach out we'd love to set up a demo to walk you through how you could use it or um or you can always just create a free account and start playing around and, and give it a try today so i hope that helps